those who don't know, Stacey Abrams is a is an American politician. She's a lawyer. She's a voting rights activist. She is also an author, and she served in the House of Representatives from 2007 to, to, to 2017. She served on the minority leader. She was the minority leader from 2011 to 2017. Stacy Abram was the person who got the team together in Georgia who helped to bring, to help to change Georgia from a red state to a blue state. I know a lot of people don't want to accept it, don't want to believe it, don't want to accept what's in front of their face. They're still running around saying that God said that 45 will be in the White House for four more years. Well, God, I don't know what God told you that, your God did, but my God told me that Joe Biden will be president for the next four years. I believe that God hears and answers prayers. I know he answers my prayers. And I believe and have faith to know that this country will be all right. I thank God for Stacey Abram and what vision and revelation that he has put into that young lady. The, the way she goes around and works for the country, for the people. She put people first. She don't think about herself, her own selfish needs. She thinks of others. Stacey Abram is an American icon, is someone we need to look up, someone we need to be thankful for, for God bringing her into our life, for how she goes about working, putting things together, the uh, intelligence that she has, and the desire and the thirst to do what's right for people, all people, not just certain people, not just the Republicans, but for all people. I would like to thank the state of Georgia for how you showed up and showed out. You did what you had to do, and I thank God for it. I give him the glory, the honor, and the praise. And come January 5th, I look for you all to continue to show up and show out, to do what you need to do. That we need to, most of all, we need to pray that this country comes together. Not saying that one party is communist. I've heard that they saying that the Democrats is communist. They're baby killers. All they want to do is kill the babies, which is a lie. It is a lie. But people believe it. I can't change their mind. I believe what I want to believe, and you believe what you want to believe. That's what we have here, but it's not right. The Democrats are not trying to change this country into a communist party. You need to get your facts straight. I know you believe what you believe and, and saying that God is calling the babies, the babies, the death, you're killing the babies. And if truth be known, a lot of them who are running around here doing all this jipper jabbering.
my heart's desire I'm growing into a flower and glamorous Getting ready for my miracle Getting ready for greatness Getting ready for my heart's desire I'm growing into a flower and glamorous Getting ready for my miracle Getting ready for greatness Getting ready for my heart's desire I'm growing into a flower and glamorous